Mix and mingle with local and national baseball personalities at the 8th Annual Hot Stove Banquet. The event will benefit the Richmond Flying Squirrels Charities. We have a tasty preview with the head chef and director of banquet services for the team. But first, the executive director of community outreach, Megan Angstead, along with Sam Ravitch with broadcasting and media, are here to fill us in on what this event is all about. Good morning. Good morning. Good Thanks morning. for having us. You're welcome. I love the shirt. Funville. That's Thank a whole you. new concept for the squ squirrels, isn't it? It is, yes. For the 2018 season, um, we've unveiled the concept of Funville. So when you come out to the Diamond now, you're coming to Funville. Um, our slogan's always been, have fun, go nuts. And we just wanted to put a name um, to that brand and, and be able to celebrate everyone coming out to the Diamond and enjoying their night. What fun. <laughs> we love it. And you spell it, of course, with the double N's like you mm -hmm. always do with fun. The Hot Stove Banquet. I was reading a little bit about this. This is actually something that goes on nationwide, isn't it? It is, yes. We're one of several teams um, across minor league baseball that hosts the Hot Stove Banquet. Um, and this will be our eighth annual one that we have coming up next week. Explain the concept. Well, it's really a, a time to get everyone in the community together, season ticket holders, um, and benefit a great cause, too. I mean, building some ballparks for kids just to get out and play sports. And, and I think it's we got some great people coming. I'm a little biased, but um, uh, it should be really exciting. So You're allowed to be biased. And this is a great time because, obviously, there's no baseball going on right now. Right. You can kind of, if you're a baseball fan, it gives you an opportunity to immerse yourself in something baseball-ish. Absolutely, absolutely. <laughs> we have um, some great people coming out. Our new manager for the team, Willie Harris, is going to be joining us that night, so we're excited to introduce him to the Richmond community. Um, and we're also going to be having our keynote speaker, Carl Ravitch, um, from ESPN, and that's uh, uh, Sam's tie-in. That's actually Sam's dad. <laughs> so we're going to have a father-son interview session going on oh, on fun. the stage at, at the banquet, which should be really cool. So you're going to throw your dad some curveballs? Well, the, uh, <laughs> the best part about it is I, I'm going to ask him some questions. I'm going to interview him, so uh, I know if he's telling the truth. And that's, that's going to be uh, the best part about it. We'll, we'll sing some truth serum in there. And I don't see know. You might be surprised with some truths. Uh, you, you can't handle the truth. Right? <laughs> That's always fun. That's got to be kind of fun, though, to, to be able to talk to your dad and, and, and open up for the public some of the things that he's been um, doing. Oh, absolutely. Yeah, and uh, it's it's exciting because we're now both in the same kind of industry. So, uh, you know, I bounce ideas off of him now and he bounces some off me. So uh, it'll be really cool to kind of put that on display because, I mean, basically this is just a phone call that he and, he and I might have uh, just on a regular day and then we're just you know in, in the public eye so um, we're really excited about it I know it's it's benefiting a, a fantastic cause too so um, really excited about getting everyone together and, and getting excited about the baseball season oh yeah that's gonna be fun let's talk about the Richmond Flying Squirrels charities because they're so active in the community and a lot of people don't even realize that that you do so much yeah well, our community impact has always been an important part of what we do as an organization and about four years ago, we started our own charity arm, um, our own 501c3 Flying Squirrels Charities, uh, which has been a lot of fun to just enhance that community impact that we've been doing. And our current project with the charity has been to renovate um, and rebuild some inner city youth baseball fields right, right in, in Richmond. We've been working with our friends at the Parks and Rec Department to um, understand what fields kids could be playing on if they were um, maintained better so so we've been trying to take care of that putting money into those fields and and just getting kids playing the game of baseball that's a, it's a project called renovating richmond's recreation yes. which is wonderful so let's talk about how we can come to the event absolutely yeah <laughs> it is next week on thursday january 25th we do still have tickets available and all you have to do is give our office a call um, or go on our website we have tickets online and we'd love to see you out there it starts at 5 30 at the uh, siegel center over at bcu Oh, that sounds like fun. So we know who the special guest is, your dad, but are any other special guests on tap? Yeah, absolutely. We'll have Chris Shaw, who's one of the Giants' top prospects. The top prospect The, the top prospect. Yeah. Okay, so he played with us a little bit last year, got called up to AAA, so we're bringing him back to Richmond. We'll also have Tony Beasley, who is the um, Texas Rangers' third base coach, and he's a uh, Bowling Green, Virginia native. So his whole family is coming in. Uh, we're going to be awarding him with um, – our Richmond Baseball Impact Award. Uh, he's a cancer survivor and still in the game, heavily involved in the game of baseball. So we're excited to have him. Oh, it's going to be quite the night, Megan. And um, thank you so much for joining us today. Absolutely. Thanks so All much right. for having us. And looking forward to seeing your dad out there. Thank you. Yeah, we're excited. <laughs> yeah, the eighth annual Hot Stove Banquet is Thursday, January 25th at the VCU Siegel Center with proceeds benefiting the Richmond Flying Squirrels Charities. And by the way, the Richmond Flying Squirrels opening day is Friday, April 13th. I think that's the first time it's on a Friday, right? It is. Oh, Yes. Big night. <laughs> We're going to put a link to more details on the banquet and the squirrels' upcoming season on our website. Just go to WTBR.com.
VTM by later today. This looks like an event you do not want to miss.